About an hour ago, Fort Worth voted to toughen smoking restrictions all across the city. Not everyone likes the change that's coming. Ken Molestina live for us over at City Hall. Ken, word is that council wasn't in agreement over the ban. Talk to us about that. Yeah, there was uh, one council member, Doug, uh, who was not in favor of at least the way that the ordinance was worded, but it did pass with overwhelming support, 8 to 1. A lot of people did expect that. So now bingo halls as well as uh, bars in the area, they're going to have up to 90 days to comply with this ordinance. Take a listen to what it was like when that vote was made. Motion carries. At Fort Worth City Hall, council chambers erupted with applause tonight after that 8-1 to one vote passed. The smoking ordinance now is in effect. The only council member, once again, who voted against it, that was Kerry Moon. He said that he does agree that secondhand smoke is, in fact, dangerous, but he said the way that the ordinance was written is bad governance. Under this move, smoking will be banned inside bars and inside of bingo halls. Smoke shops will also be prohibited from operating within 300 feet of schools, universities, and hospitals. Tonight's vote comes after a years of debating this issue, and it now makes Fort Worth the 17th city in North Texas to adopt a comprehensive smoking ban ordinance. They've had a strong community response and um, a lot of public support, both from uh, the city council members, but as well as the community at large. But I do believe that bingo halls should have been exempted because there's so many elderly that no one was speaking up for that have smoked all their lives, and they all need somewhere to go. And once again, there were only a handful of people who uh, spoke out against the ordinance. Uh, city council members say that they're not going to use that 90-day period, Doug, uh, to make any necessary adjustments to the ordinance and perhaps to the way that it reads. So they said within 90 days, they will perfect this and it will go into effect. We're live outside Fort Worth City Hall. Ken Molestina, CBS 11 News. Ken, thanks for the update.